I'm gonna take a little trip all the way through the Milky Way in our solar system to a planet called Mars, and that's courtesy of our next guest. I'm excited for this one. Please give it up for spacecraft engineer. It's Sean, everyone! Yeah. <laughs> I want to get this right. Is your job title Industrial Manager Orion ESM and ESM2 AIT Scheduler at Airbus Defence and Space? Yes, that's right. But essentially what it means is that I'm a spacecraft engineer. I help to make machines like this that do important jobs for us up in space. Right, OK. Well, we're talking about the Red Planet today and you brought along a pretty cool toy with you. Explain what this guy is. So this is Bruno. So he's a test model for the ExoMars rover. So the ExoMars rover um, is a rover that we're going to send to Mars. Um, and it's going to go there to do some important science for us and, and send the information back to us here on Earth. Wow. So what does he do on Mars then? So the special thing about the ExoMars rover is that it's got a really big drill on the front, so a two metre long drill, and it'll drill right down into the ground of Mars, extract some samples, put them into its onboard laboratory and then analyse them and send us back the data. Wow, well I hear a lot of talk all the time about like travel to Mars, space travel to Mars, scientists trying to get to Mars. Why is Mars special compared to the rest of the planets in the solar system? So Mars is our next door neighbour, if you like. It's a planet that's potentially a little bit similar to Earth in some ways. Um, and if we go to Mars and we do some analysis on the surface, it might help us to understand a bit more about the history of Mars, other planets and the solar system in general. Wow, it is an impressive piece of kit. And how long does it take to build one of these things? Well, something like this takes a really, really long time. I think for, um, for this rover, more than 15 years from the original idea up to um, up to launch. 15 years? That is incredible. Can I have a go at driving it? Yeah, sure. So it's all done through this computer here. Okay. So let me just set this up for you. And what's so special about this rover? Thank you. Oh, I feel special. <laughs> well, it's really special, this one, because um, it essentially can navigate itself. It can drive around by itself on the surface of Mars. So it uses its cameras to look ahead at the terrain, work out where's safe to go, where's not, okay. um, and also where it would like to stop to take its samples. So right. that's a really cool thing about this rover. I've just pressed the button like one minute. Oh, there, there it is. <laughs> no, it's obviously not built for speed, but... Why is it so slow? <laughs> so, OK, it's slow because we're limited as to how much power we have. All the power that we get for this spacecraft comes from the sun through the solar panels. So we don't want to waste all of that energy by driving really, really fast. We want to save some of that energy so that we can um, do our experiments on the onboard lab laboratory. And we've laid down some carpet today in the BP studio. Why did you want us to do that? <laughs> so Bruno here is really heavy, and he also has really sharp wheels made from metal. So if we didn't have this carpet, I'm pretty sure it would chew up your lovely floor here. <laughs> that would not be a good idea. And how many spacecraft have been to Mars already? So if we're talking about rovers, um, only about six have successfully landed on Mars and, and started driving around. So it's really not many. And actually, most of those are, are American rovers. We've never had a European rover go to Mars. So the ExoMars rover will be the first. That is incredible. And the even cooler thing is that the winner of our awesome orbit competition will get to have a go at controlling Bruno on a replica Martian landscape. Whoa. How cool is that, everyone? <laughs> Jan, thank you very much. I'm going to actually hand the controls back over thank to you because you. I do not want to break Bruno.